Hi, I'm Dr. Shruti K. Bharadwaj, presently working as consultant neonatologist and pediatrician in Cloud9 Hospital, Belandur. Cold extremities or otherwise called hypothermia, it happens in children uh, when the body temperature is less than 35 degrees Celsius or in infants and neonates when the body temperature goes below 36 degrees Celsius. So the most common cause of cold extremities with restlessness is excessive exposure to cold air or water. This can happen in infants because they have large body surface area as well as less subcutaneous fat. So if it is not treated properly then it can lead to serious problems. The symptoms of coldness in infants are they can have shivering whereas in neonates or newborns they may not present with uh, shivering. There can be poor feeding, poor activity, restlessness or clumsiness, excessive passing of uh, urine and um, breathing at a faster rate than usual. The other important cause of cold extremities with uh, clumsiness or restlessness is uh, if the baby has loose tools along with dehydration and the other most important thing is infection with shock. So how to detect whether my baby has cold extremities? So there is a simple test palpate the abdomen as well as the extremities that is the palms and soles of the baby with the back of your fingers. So the normal thing is the body as well as the extremities should be warm like each other. If the extremities are cold but the abdomen is warm it means that the baby is becoming cold. If the extremities are cold as well as the abdomen is also cold that means the baby has already become cold. What can the parents do if they find that the child has cold extremities and the baby is restless? So immediately remove the wet clothing, put a warm clothing and uh, cover the baby with a blanket. Put the socks, mittens and uh, cap to the baby. Keep the room warm. If the AC is on, keep the temperature at 26 to 28 degrees Celsius. If the windows are open, keep it closed and uh, as well if the if other signs are there, like if the baby is not feeding well, if there is poor activity along with loose tools, fever and then the baby is restless, then you need to show to the doctor immediately as it could be a sign of infection which needs to be uh, evaluated and treated.